We have an update on the hundreds of thousands of incidents that were reported to the Houston Police Department and closed due to a shortage in staffing. Fox 26's Domily Keith is live outside HPD headquarters after speaking with Houston's police chief. Domily. Yeah, Houston Police Chief Troy Finners apologizing to the entire Houston community, specifically to the victims who have had their cases suspended because of the staffing shortage at HPD. The chief is also explaining how he plans to help still get these victims justice, although HPD recently learned it is too late for at least one victim who died by suicide. I want the survivors, their family members, our community to know that we're going to fix this. We've made a lot of progress in just a few weeks. In fact, the 264,000 incidents reported to the Houston Police Department that were closed and coded suspended due to lack of manpower since 2016 have now been under review since late last month. This code should have never been used and it never will be used again. Cases with this code include 4,017 sexual assaults, 6,537 from homicide, but the chief says most of those are assaults and threats. Before 2018, the Major Assaults Division was in the homicide unit. Major assaults, by the way, make up 109,000 of the incidents, and 91,000 are from the Property and Financial Crimes Division. I know that there's disappointment and pain, though damaged. There's still a level of trust in our city, and I'm grateful for that. Chief Finner says HPD needs an additional 2,000 officers and admits some areas are left uncovered. It's like Swiss cheese right now, okay? Got holes everywhere. Using overtime and personnel from code enforcement and community affairs, investigators and supervisors have reviewed more than 3,000 of these cases so far, and they're contacting the victims. Some staff yeah. members who typically don't do that are now assigned to do it? Yes. Chief Finner says after finding out in 2021 this short staffing code was being used, he gave an order for it to stop. Two high-ranking members of HPD have now been demoted because of it. There's an internal affairs investigation, and just a day before this news conference, Mayor John Whitmire announced he's ordered a third-party independent review. We're going to fix this problem, and we're going to be a better department moving forward. So were most of these suspended cases from a particular area of town? The chief says he doesn't believe so, but that's all part of the investigation, as well as is it too late for some of the cases because of the statute of limitations? And how was it possible for this code to be used for violent crimes when we're told it was supposed to be used for things like car break-ins with no evidence or incidents that were reported simply for civil cases or for insurance claims, not for violent crimes? Reporting live in downtown Houston, I'm Domalee Keith, Fox 26 News.